Okay, guys, here's a lesson. Sharon uh, Bromberg, Panic Covers It. Uh, fun song, kind of teasing our band a little bit, but I'm going to show you how to work through it. <laughs> actually pretty easy so for some beginner folks you may like it or something you want to play in a band but uh, anyway so it's an A and uh, so there's your A chord, chord uh, power A chord okay I'm really just hitting the A string the B string and the G string the triad and notes so it's one two if you can you can do it a number of ways, but it's open E, E third fret, fourth fret, fifth fret. So it's that's the same note. That's an A note there. That's an A note there. So you're playing. You could do it there, but you know. Like, or you could do it with bar chords, you know, but that's that part. Okay, and then the little lick <laughs> is just, it's a minor scale. You know, but I, I, I was trying to show you an easier way, but I guess to do it correctly, the formation is... So you're on the uh, B string, fifth fret, seventh fret, and then there's the flattened third, which makes it a minor on the sixth fret. Then right back. So it's five. Uh, we're on, we're on the same string, same string the whole time. B string, fifth, seventh, eighth, seventh. Fifth, fifth, seventh, eighth, tenth, eighth, seventh, fifth. And here's the correct finger. Okay. All right, and then the rest of it is. So then that run, we're going to start on the A, which is the E string on the 5th fret. Okay, so that's just uh, uh, E string 5th fret twice, A string 2nd fret, A string 3rd fret, 4th fret. What I like to do is, is, is on that D note, go straight to the bar chord. Notice I'm doing my pinky here. Okay, so it's. A. E. Okay, so we've got this part. Right, the way I do this chord, this little blues chord here, 
uh, is basically, um, this is a D chord, bar chord, but uh, I'm just hitting two strings, okay, right here. Or you could do a bar chord, but I'm, and, and what I'm doing is, is I'm hitting the, uh, the A string and the D string, and uh, I've got my pointer finger on the fifth fret on the A string, and I've got my ring finger on the seventh fret of the D string. And then I, this finger here is kind of leaning over so that it mutes this string. You see? You know, all this muting and stuff is stuff you got to work on. Uh, if that's hard for you, you could just do the bar chord. You know, and just approach these two strings. But I'm, you know, so it's like. And you know, actually, the way I'm kind of. So it's really, it's a pull off here on that fourth fret, and that kind of makes it easier to get here. And then I'm taking, so I'm doing that, and I'm taking my pinky finger, and I'm hammering it down on the, uh, on the D string, on the, was that the ninth fret? Yeah. And then I'm moving to the A note. Same thing, but just moving it, and, and now I'm doing that same formation, but on the E string and the A string. That's an E note. To the D, A. Stay up here if that's easier for you. And then so you can do that. You can do that whole uh, formation there if bar chords are hard for you with uh, with regular uh, with these notes. That's a D like a little blues deal to an A. To an A, to D, you know, the whole point is there's more than one way to skin a cat. <laughs> so basically, uh, not that I have anything against cats, but basically, you know, that's it. Enjoy.